integrated ship model, of course. There was some sort of software called integrated ship model. The basic concept of, of ICM is that the winner at the end gets all the chips, but he doesn't get all the money. And oftentimes online, you know, the winner will get like 600, and second place gets 450. The winner may get 15% of the money online. Uh, and in live tournaments, it might be a little bit more, you know, winner might get double second. But you don't get all the chips. And so this is, this is a very important point. It was discussed. Uh, term poker for advanced players by Sklansky you know, a few years ago. He said, you, know, you get more chips, they're, they're worth less in a tournament. This is generally true. Some people at the time said, well, no, you can bully you with the more chips, but, which is also a point which we'll get to. Uh, but now most people understand that, that they really are worth less. And they're, I'm not going to get into the whole mathematical formulas for this. And I've been math degree from a good school. And you know, I, am, I understand the math very well intuitively. There's no point in my bringing out a bunch of formulas and everything because it, it would not not be helpful. You know, it's it's useful for somebody who really wants to understand understand this you know, mathematically, but it's more important to understand than the concept. So any, anyway, uh, hanging in there, uh, you, know, you can move up in places, and and so oftentimes you could take a gamble, and you know you know you would hope to you know, be a gamble and cash game would be good because we'd profitably pick up chips. But it's not not a good gamble because you know you might bust out and 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 you could just hang in there and move up in places basically. Now we'll discuss this a little bit. Moving up in places, you know, sometimes people do that a little too far, and even before they understood about ICM directly, people tend to do that a little too much. So, but but, it, but there is a lot of value in it. So the big flip lay in the tournament. You know, you, a lot of times you can't avoid it. You know, you have two pair against the combo draw, or ace king against jacks free flop, or whatever. So you have to get it all in, but you know, if you can avoid these things, you want to because uh, it benefits the players not in hand. On the other hand, you know, you don't want to play too tight and just fold everything because you might have a big gamble. So this is a tricky situation. Uh, chip EV versus dollar EV. Okay, chip EV is the expected chip value. This is kind of language you see on 2 plus 2. Um, so basically, if you if you push and you calculate the probabilities that you just steal, what probabilities you, you get called and lose, you get called and win, and and you figure multiply the probabilities by the amount of chips you have each each of those add those together, and you get your uh, chip expected value. Uh, so it's on average how many chips you would gain or lose. So a lot of times something can be uh, chip EV, but the plus but CV plus means you expect to gain some chips.